Hello and welcome to South West London TV. I'm Kay Cho Han and I'm here at the iconic Battersea Arts Centre, not too far down the road from Clapham Junction. We're here on a chilly morning to catch up with some young people who'll be pitching their business ideas to as part of a £2,000 competition. It's part of a business and creative change initiative called The Agency, being run by the Arts Centre. Let's go inside to speak to Liz who can tell us a bit more about it. So I'm now here inside the Battersea Arts Centre. I'm here with Liz Morton. Liz, can you tell us a little bit about what's happening today? Yes, um, we're at Battersea Arts Centre. It's the panel day for the agency, which is our creative social entrepreneurship programme for young people who live in this area. Um, and they're going to be doing seven minute pitches um, and hopefully winning um, some money to develop their projects even further. So have you been working with the youngsters to develop their pitches or are they just coming straight in from the cold? We've been working with them for the last 12 weeks, every Saturday and every Wednesday. They've been developing their ideas for change within their areas. So some of them have got ideas around food, music, um, recycling, fashion, loads of different really exciting creative ideas. And they're going to go up in front of a panel of six people, including the local MP and the chair of the Arts Council and a social entrepreneur. So it's a very high level panel um, who are going to be very robust in their feedback. So Claire, you were the first one up with your pitch. How did you find the process? It actually went really well, even though I had a few technical difficulties. So my idea is actually named after myself. It's called Lawton and it is a safe space to create visual art um, so that those who are taking part, who are where it's aimed at young carers who may be going through difficulties or stresses of life actually can come and create visual art in a safe space to actually help bring about a victory and excellence in their situation that they may change their life with it. The caring process, it actually just forces its way into your whole life where it kills your dreams, your aspirations and I'm basically here to help those people to aspire again. Claire, wish you best of luck, fingers crossed for you. So we've just stepped away from the uh, panel interviews and I've got a Divine and Jariah here. Hello. And you're from Spot the Light. Can, tell me a bit about um, what happened inside. He went in and started rapping. I was like, okay, cool. That, 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 put, um, that made me more confident. I was thinking, cool, you got this. We're sons of God and we're talented. The only thing is that we choose the roles over music. I just want to balance it. And now I'm trying to make a change. Put a social platform on the map. We've got people that sing in blocks or, in, or like in showers and then don't take a feather. So I was thinking, yeah, let's, let's do something that would change lives. So... Yeah, we thought about our talent show. Mm. Man, come right out of them flats. Let's make sounds in these tracks. Me and you, we can do this. Let's put ones off on the map. Let's put ones off on the map. Well, best of luck, guys. Um, a really a strong performance and I uh, wish you the best. Thank you so Thank much. Thank you very much. So we've got Sally here who's just pitched her idea for Lino Studios. Hello, Sally. Hello. So how did it go for you? It was kind of great experience. A bit nervous, but um, the panel was very... Um, relaxed and they're very nice and they smile so I thought they made me feel a bit comfortable and able to share my um, my idea. So my idea is called Lion Studio and it's a contemporary dance club only for girls aged 15 to um, 25 and it's focused on girls who've been bullied, girls um, with lower self-esteem and, and disadvantaged girls who can't afford dance class. So um, the money will provide um, dance teachers so I'm partnership with the Royal Dance Academy and also um, it, the money will also be used for um, bursary for the um, girls so I pick to recruit for my company. Yeah. Anyway, Sally, I wish you the best of luck. Fingers crossed for you. Yeah, thank you. So I'd like to congratulate all the winners today and the participants. And if you'd like to find out more about their stories or find out more about the agency or take part in next year's competition, then do follow them on Twitter and uh, you'll get the latest details. I'm Kay Chahan and this is South West London TV.